Hi, this is Lauren from LSP Actions and I'm going to show you how you can install your presets into Lightroom, formerly Lightroom CC. That's this version of Lightroom here if you subscribe to Creative Cloud. This is also a way of getting uh, the presets into your Lightroom Mobile as well. You add them to this version of Lightroom and you'll see this Lightroom Mobile on your phone or tablet. The presets will add there automatically. This is not to be confused with the Lightroom Classic, which you also have on your CC subscription. Um, I much prefer using this version of Lightroom because you can also install the LSP custom brushes into this version of Lightroom. If you want to know how to install and use uh, your presets into this version of Lightroom, Lightroom Classic 8.3 or 8.2.1 and above should I say, um, then please do check out the other videos on YouTube. But for now I'm going to show you how to install them into Lightroom CC. So the first thing to do is to locate your download from LSP. This will be in a zip file. How you extract the files from this file is done, it all depends on your operating system, whether you're Mac or PC or whatever. Um, so please do take to Google to find out how to extract a zip folder from your download if you're unsure. I'm going to right click extract all um, because I'm on a PC. So this is just doing this in the background. This is just extracting here. You can see it's making a, a new folder here. So that's just opening up now. There we go. So you can open this one up here and you'll see you have the LSP. Oh, sorry, just glitched there. Um, you will see you have the LSP um, presets unzipped here and you still have the zipped version as well. So because you've unzipped them, you can now open this one up uh, the LSP Newborn Lightroom presets, you have brushes and presets. Um, the brushes again, they are for this version of Lightroom or Lightroom CS4 to CS6. If we're installing into this version of Lightroom, Lightroom CC and your mobile, you're going to want to open the presets folder here. And you can locate Lightroom CC and mobile. You have the newborn preset workflow, um, this is the one I'm installing, you may have the studio white linen, whichever set you have, um, this format will be the same. So I'm just going to pop that out of the way and open up Lightroom here. In the bottom of your developing panel you have um, an option that says presets. Before installing your LSP presets, you want to locate the folder here called user presets. You might not have this. If you don't, that's cool. But if you do, you're going to want to right click and rename this to something different, such as uh, my presets perhaps, or, or something else like that. Um, this is because when you install LSP, you want them to be in their own folder, not all kind of jumbled in and mixed with the other presets here. I'm going to come up here, import presets. And I'm going to go ahead and uh, locate the folder, the download folder, where um, I put the newborn presets. So you're going to want to do that. And open up the unzipped or extracted folder. Go on presets and locate Lightroom CC and mobile. Open this up and select all these files inside. These are XMP files, these are your presets. So make sure they're all selected there and hit import. This is loading the presets into Lightroom. And you will notice they have come up um, under here called user presets. This is why um, a minute ago I said if you already have a file, a file called user presets to rename it because it's going to want to add them into a user presets. Hopefully by the time um, Lightroom has updated a couple of times it may lose this ability because it didn't used to do this. Um, so you may be able to get them straight away into a folder that says um, LSP and the title of your presets, but if not, that's fine. You can simply right click again, rename the group and call it, you know, LSP presets. Uh, which presets depends on which presets you have downloaded. For example, I'm going to name this set the LSP newborn presets. Now I can open this and I can see all the presets here. I simply need to hover over a preset to see the effect over the image. And when I'm happy, I can click the preset and it will apply it to my image. You can also come here in the develop section and you can tweak the preset further if you want to. 
SP comes in sections, um, so for example that was a base section um, and we can change the lights here we have a shadows and highlights section um, so Tonus is obviously drawn to some reds here because these are newborn presets <laughs> Anyway, so on and so forth. To figure out how to actually um, use your presets uh, from LSP, please, please please watch the specific videos related to your presets. This is an installation video. Any questions, please do um, come and join the LSP Facebook group. And yeah, enjoy your LSP presets. These will also show on your mobile device as well.